Hello guys, welcome to Linux Joy channel. Uh, yesterday, in my previous class, you observed how to create a user with user at command and with different options. Today, we are going to see to use that user at command with some different options. So, let's get started. So, first, I open my virtual machine here, open the terminal, gnome m I and L so maximum is screen and increase the font. So observe here cat slash etc slash pa sswd. Here you can observe two users Rian and Linux Joy. Whenever I create these users, they automatically create the home folder for their users in slash home directory. That is slash home slash rian slash home slash linux joy. So I'm going to do some different here. So I am creating one directory and I am going to assign that directory to a home folder for particular user. So before that I am going to create one directory that is mkdir t slash centos slash gaoy. Joy. So now I created this directory. I am going to assign this directory as a home folder to a particular user. So the username, for example, I take it as a joy. So user add hyphen d. What is the folder? C E N T centos slash J O Y and the username is joy. So it's showing that warning the home directory already exists. That means the directory already exists. It's 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 telling like that. But we are but we are here assigning that directory to the assigning as a home directory to a particular user that is joy user. So not copying any files from scale directory into it. So scale directory is nothing but it has the user configuration files before login as a joy user we have to copy those files to into this centos joy folder so where is that folder cd slash etc slash skel this is the directory and when you type ls you don't find here nothing so when you type ls a you find this all hidden files these files should be in our slash sent to os slash joy folder then only you can log in as a normal user so i am going to copy these files so to copy a hidden files cp a so and where is that uh, where are the files slash etc slash skel skill slash dot and uh, where i have to copy these files the destination is slash sent os joy here so i copied the sorry i copied the all user configuration files from slash etc slash scale to slash sent os slash joy so now login switch user iphone j o y joy so this is the way to login as a normal user here without password you can login here because you already login as a root user so if you create any user you can just switch that particular user so joy here i have linux joy and rian there is no need to give password here but I have to log in in command line interface, but I have to give the password. So for that, I have to log out and assign the password PASSWD password for joy. Okay, send OS 7. Send OS 7. Now the password is set, but here you no need to submit the password. See, just log in. But in command line interface, 
here you can you have to give the password so username is joy and the password is sent over yes so say pwd who am i so that's in this way you can create a directory and assign that directory as a home folder to a particular user so log out and come to graphical user interface next you can assign a account expiry date also for suppose i created uh, a user and uh, that means the user has the account the account should be i'm i'm going to give a date at that date the account will be expired that means the user will be expired on that particular date for that i have to use this command user at iphone g here the format is first you have to give the year 2018 okay and next month that means 05 next date 25 so the user i can give any name here rambo user add slash is been permission denied okay okay i am trying to this execute this command in normal user so i log in as a user so i am going to add, use this command so it's not possible but because the user don't have that privileges that means super user have that privileges to execute this command so i'm log out from log out from the user so now i can Execute the same command. User add iPhone e two zero one eight iPhone zero five iPhone twenty five. That means uh, you already explained two zero one eight is nothing but your year. Zero five is month and twenty fifth is our date. At that on that particular date, the account going to be expired. So I can give any name Rambo. the user is created and now i am going to check the check the details about that user so rambo here you can find so last password change march 19201 that is today and password inactive never password expires never password inactive never and so you can observe here account expires on may 25 2018 exactly the date we assigned here here so in this way you can add a expiry date on your particular user account next you can add a uh, comment when you create a user so here You can observe here how to add a comment. User add iPhone C. So comment you have to type in like Manish Sharma. Manish Sharma. Sorry, his full name, but uh, the user name will be M A N I S H. Manish. now the user is created now i am going to see that user is created or not where i have to find cat slash etc slash pa this is wd so here you can observe joy user and the sent to is slash joy is a home directory so i created this directory first and after that i sent this directory as a home folder for joy user and next i created rambo user with account expiry date next i created manish directory with a custom command here you can observe after user id and group id next one is comment manish sharma is a username but i gave his login username as manish only in this way you can add a comment to your particular user now next so i am going to here you can observe every time i create a user the default shell is slash bin slash bash 
slash bin slash bash every time so here we are going to see how many shells that we have for that cat slash etc slash shelln okay sorry shells not shell shells so these are the shells slash bin sh slash bin bash under slash bin slash no login and slash bin slash tc sh slash bin slash csh and this uh, slash user slash bin slash sh and slash user slash bin slash bash are the extensions of these files so basically we have one two three four five files and these three are extensions bin sh bin bash has been no lag so i am creating a user with slash s bin slash no login as a default shell so for that i have to use this command user add hyphen s so i am going to add the default shell as slash s bin slash no login so slash s bin slash no login so the username would be tabo so i created a user and i am going to check that user is created or not cat slash etc slash pss wd grep so the name is tgr see you can observe here slash has been slash no login as a default shell i assign this shell to this toggle user can compare here also cat slash etc slash pss wd also so joy bin bash linux joy bin bash and rambo bin bash manish also bin bash but when i created the tag the default shell here changed slash is bin slash no login so in this way we can use user add command with the different options so this is the session today i planned for thank you watching my video and if you have any doubts please do mention in the comments please share this video to your friends as many as you can and uh, and tell them to subscribe my channel to latest updates on their youtube channel thanks for watching my video have a nice day